Oh wow, they're getting in close. That's very impressive. I mean, you're not going to break through this level of health, and I have another revive on the back end. You just make me even stronger if you did. So please, please hurt me. Please hurt me more. Yay, level ups. Yay, enemies dying horribly. Thanks for messing around. It's more vampire survivors. This time we're going to be seeing what we can max out with Brownie over on Inlay Library and possibly other stages. Let's get that nice bouncy effect down right around. Rune Tracer. I want Rune Tracer. Yeah, I do. Because we're going to be bouncing things, maxing out with armor. Da, 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 da. <laughs> hey, it's Kizabur. That goes with armor. And its area will go up to a gigantic amount. This cooldown is gonna go down. Oh yeah. Alright, my weapons are already grabbed. Now I just need my passives. Hey look, empty tome. Everyone's favorite. It goes with every build ever. And armor. And evolves three weapons. Wow. Hey, what's this? Perhaps I should have done this from the start. Damn bloodline, oh yeah. Now, obviously it's a bit of a cheaty thing to try and run with the Vine Bloodline, but who cares? Let's see how Brownie can do with it. Because with that basically big area he's gonna be getting. That'll be really good for this, though. So many Arcana to grab. Yep. Sonic Bloom doing its stuff on stages that aren't ridiculously overtuned. Yeah, it turns out having an absolute ton of damage is very helpful. car in a library? What is this? Some state with a ridiculous amount of crime? Ha 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 ha! That's just said auto accidents. Bounce off. Die off. You got wrecked. Armor max? Armor max. I did not select armor. Why did I even remotely say that? Jeez. Because he gets area naturally with the cooldown reduction, he might not need Boogaloo of Illusions in comparison to some other characters. Look at just how big it is right now. Oh, hey, Atlantean. That's without getting other power-ups and stuff involved, too. Yeah. Yep, here we go. Now, of course, I could have gone Divine Bloodline and made it even bigger from the start. But damage... Damage is... Well, Divine Bloodline does give damage. Huh. Yeah. You'll want as much raw might as you can because of how the evolved weapon works. It has a very high base damage, so being able to power that up very helpful. And guess what is going to power it up with Divine Bloodline? Legionary? Wow! Of course it would be better if I actually grabbed it from the start and started popping it early, but hey. I wouldn't be this many videos in with so few views if I was anything remotely resembling competent. But for those of you who are watching, I do thank you. YouTube does not like to give impressions. It is strange like that, eh? All 
Alrighty, more stuff to smack down. Oh. Wow, that was deceptively long reach on the cloak. Still 300 health, they're not going to take that down all that quickly. Hey, chicken. Even if it does lower my damage. Still, once the wave cannon gets it out, it's going to be completely off the hook. What is that? It should not be that windy. Why does it sound like the building is coming apart? Now, is there a semi or something doing stuff outside? That would make sense. And even with all this might, it just does not do a lot of raw upfront damage, huh? Banish you to the abyss. Yep, you got crushed, son. You got crushed. There's the boss, not the evolution chest. That's the weird lion face thing. Man, it's always so weird coming back. Things like this. They're lower in threat. And then the lion still struggles. Shortcut is terrible. So bad. And after enough difficulties, I would almost say it would still be better than Diver Mine. But Diver Mine would be much better here because of the bookcases. Don't get the red gem. They're lasting a while. Now well, the raw front damage isn't great. There's that. Now, well, hopefully I evolve the right one. Wave Cannon first. Set two candy boxes from random events. Jeez. Right, a weird floating lion head. Oh, nope, you're not dead just yet. Oh man, another level up I didn't want. Power good. That's four levels that could have limit broken to something more useful. There we go. Yay, wave cannon. That a third candy box. Good grief. I maximize the wave damage with might. Doesn't matter. Three to hundred damage hits without anything really buffing it up any farther. Yeah, there's no future. Right now I can actually bother to grab some of these. Is that? No. It must have come up earlier. Oh, I'm out one. Silver ring. Oh, how I long for you, silver ring. There's the other Arcana bat. Wait, why are there two bats? You don't need that much. Oh, you were a regular bat. Right, and there's my retaliation, which will send my damage into the stratosphere. Bye-bye, Atlantean. Right now, I just sit here and let them bounce. 400 damage hits, pretty good. And it's about to get gooder. Reroll. 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 Five hundred damage. I'm not gonna get much retaliation out of this, huh? No, oh, it's still popping off. It's still popping off. The higher that goes, the better it is. Obviously, Wicked Season from the start with Divine Bloodline would be much better doing raw damage. 
Up to 600s now. Now, of course, any weapon could do this, but the sheer much higher base might of the weapon does help considerably. 700. Wow, my health is skyrocketing. There's no cap on Divine Bloodline damage. No cap. Right, once I start getting for a thousand, I'm gonna go and beat up the other Atlanteans. That health bar skyrocket. We're up to almost 900 now. It's going up so quickly. Probably actually... Hmm. I mean, the base damage is so high with Phoenix Form. The Phoenix Blast. I'm debating which one of these weapons might be the best for, like, a million kill run. Is, well, obviously a Finion, because you just instant kill everything. But otherwise, there are... Well, duration doesn't affect a thing. Regular blasts are down to... Wow. What the heck is this? Did the random event break? Because that is a ridiculous amount of things, and it's only with AD lock. That's three candy boxes, a spinach, and a greed mask, too. <laughs> it's what? Two damage off of it, then 20 from the might. Uh, it's hard to tell because of how strangleholdy it gets. There's 1,100 blasts, 1,100 damage. The charge shots it fires out very fast, and it kills a lot. Yeah, should load up on more passes. Now let's see, the three of these... No. Legionary, Wave Cannon. Hmm, Legionary plus anything, really. Well, Legionary just by default. Get that, Boogaloo. And Wicked Season, and bam, nothing's gonna touch you. I think it's probably what I'm gonna do for Maruto. Just dive into the abyss, grab those Arcana, and watch the kill count soar into the trillions. Because really, there's nothing you're gonna do to that. I thought I'm out plus one, but I don't see another one. Oh, I only have one base amount. Huh. Almost to the mask. There you go. Oh, there it is. No, no. Oh, it just fired off a second one. That made it look like there was two at once. No futures, of course, doing a ton of damage as well on the back end. Just watch that go. And Legionary is so broken overpowered. And such a great way to... Alright, Phoenix Blasts are hitting for like... Well, it's hard to tell because nothing's going to get on screen with them. It looks like it's about to 1600. That's a good amount for a weapon that fires as fast as this does. The FC does more front, but it also has to rely on crits more for its biggest damage. And, uh, might, 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 mm, amount, might, more might, make brownie the mightiest there is. Might, might, yeah, with a ton of levels got up. Yay, amount. Duration doesn't even do anything for it. Why does you exist? Ooh. A good chunk of amount going on. Yeah. More Phoenix Blast, the better. 
Nothing will get on screen at this rate. Ha 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 ha. Wow, that's a lot of them out. How many levels was this? Now they're basically taking up the full screen and these aren't even showing up anymore. That's nice. Okay, you're down here. Oh man, you survived. That's lame. Well, not for long, but still. That was way later than it should have been. Oh, they get bigger the longer they go out, huh? Honestly, with the bounce, you probably don't want in the high damage areas and all that helpful. Everything will die anyway. Da, da, da. All right, here's the gold ring. No move. I said no move controller. Oh yeah, that's everything. Nothing's gonna get in through this. Not even the hag will really do it, because it has to come in at the end of the screen while the only thing spawns in halfway through. Look at that damage, you can't even tell what's happening. Yes, same BFC may have meteor hits, but this one definitely hits faster. I I don't even have the controller in my hand. Why did you move? Eighteen hundred. Wait, don't. I didn't even hit the joystick. That was with the dang D-pad. Is it the D-pad that's having me move up? Oh dang it, hag! Well, this will actually just improve my damage if anything goes wrong. Nineteen hundreds. Very good. And yet, this still wouldn't be enough for Neo Galaga because that's so high level. Four thousand can't do it. What else can? Yeah, you really don't need Oogaloo. Or Anna Labrador for him. This gets too big naturally. Good amount of kills. I'm actually going to break 100k, mostly on incidental miss, but hey. Now I'm going to well break it. I'm gonna try this out with Wicked Season next. See how it can do with more XP done. And da -da -da -da. let's throw on the Paranormal Scan as well. That should be an interesting way to do this. Yep, 2,000 hits of damage. With a weapon that fires off this much is absolutely crazy. Yeah, they increase the charge damage. Which I did not talk about once, huh? But yeah, back when it was released, the charge app didn't actually boost the damage. It got increased later along with a small patch that fixed some things. The same one that fixed Brad's no fire glitch. And now it does extra damage. And it does a lot of extra damage. That's why boosting up stuff is strong. And I'm hitting 2200. Without a build that didn't really do that much. Now let's see how it fares against Wicked Season and the Paranormal Scan next time. Oh hey. They're vaguely surviving hits. Well, they're not. There's just so many of them. And just still gonna keep going up from that retaliation. How much does it do? It's very hard to tell. Alright, Dev, let's see how much you can go through this health bar. Very quickly, it turns out. Oh, another revive now. Yep, Wave Beam outdid Legionary. Oh, no, future outdid Legionary, jeez. Alrighty, that was a good showing. Obviously, it would be less without Divine Bloodline. It's even better showing for BFC, but that's one down. More to go. 
Okay, let's see what Brownie can accomplish on the Bone Zone. And that build, that will be much, much easier than it should be. Or will it? Da 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 da, re roll. Grab everything ASAP, just burn all the re rolls since I don't really need anything else. Right, Divine Bloodline? Nope. Empty Tome. But power up. These are not what I need. That. Get the weapons first. Get everything first. Armor. Armor. Increase that retaliation damage. Well, might as well armadillo what I need. Oh, I can't armadillo what I need. Da da da. Reroll. There we go. Life sign scan. Get it to two, so Mini Ghost appears. And there's Mini Ghost. Now I just sit here and fake a mo no move challenge till I win. Oh. Yep, that's what revives are for. Now let's get all this delicious XP here. That's a lot of XP. Oh. Now I shoot faster. Da -da -da. I think that healing will keep me going. That's what rabbit fire is for. Oh. Step into the free zone. Sort of all I've got. That's another heal. Alright, charging through all of these. Armor up. And almost scan to try and max that out first. Okay, good. That was a nice bunch of levels. And now I have to wait for forever. Alright, thousands of health, more incoming. Now I gotta just try to avoid leveling until 10 minutes shows up and I can get a boss chest. Yay! That won't take forever at all. Or I could I really need to look for a light source so I can blow up Stalker immediately. Drowner too. I will be kept in. I will be kept in the fight. Okay, this is the time to go exploring for one. Okay, it's a rapid fire. Wow, a lot of barriers. Don't want to level up. Man, blew through, what was that, five barriers in a second? Yep. Nope. Rock fire is very helpful for protecting against curse season. Luck season, I want to move. I should stop when I'm in growth season barrier. Oh, dang it. It's a bit too fast on that. Oh, there's a grenade. Nice. Alright, now get nice and coddled. Well, they're not going to blow through a thousand health. Stay here till 10 minutes shows up. And hopefully... Oh, double grenade. Nice. 
Don't want to grab that. It'll probably be something very good. Oh, the bullets do so much damage. Yeah, I can't move either. Be more damage if I did that. Actually, 1,500 health. Very little short of anything but stalker to stun me at this point. Oh, the bullets get faster too? Whoa. Chicken, chicken surprise. Need to stop moving. Should have enough health to take out the boss. Why did I do that? I knew it was a bad idea. Can't not limit break. Can't not limit break. Some more of these chickens and then stay still till stalker shows up and we can grenade him and show off a ton of damage going on you showed up way earlier than you should have you're supposed to show up at 10 minutes they definitely really need the bounce without the bounce this is not good at all okay i can level up now Amount. Maximize that mitomize. Yeah. Good. Focus everything on upgrading it. Every single possible thing I can do. This is basically what I'm going to do for Maruto as well, aren't I? Da, da, da. Turn almost scanner with Legionary. Maximize health and damage. Oh, that was so many levels. Excellent. Oh, I should tag this. No, scanner isn't useful. Till it evolves. Uh, might, might amount. Free, uh. Gotta select the level ups. Can't just random always them. Oh, that was a second stalker. Wait, where's the other grenade? Wait. Did you drop a. Evolution chest at any time, so if you get like a fifth minute stalker, you could evolve it immediately. Or one minute stalker, you could evolve it instantly. And there's all three of them evolved, and my power is about to go off the chain. Heliation will keep my health low. Then I just run around grinding all this delicious growth season XP. And 500 damage already. It's only gonna get worse too. No, oh, stop moving. Yeah, it's already hitting for our 1300. This is off the charts. Ooh, there you are, kind of chest. Now, just get me some bouncy bouncies. Now it's even more ridiculous. Nothing will stop it. Nothing will stop it at all. <laughs> Take that bone zone. 30 minutes of you getting crushed to dust beneath my heel. Oh, wait. I've got to move in growth season. Got to level up. Red gem. No red gems there. Alright, almost to 50k, and I'm not even 15 minutes in. This is going to be a very high scoring round. Hey, that's what you do when you actually plan out a build to some degree. You can actually do things intelligently. Ha 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 ha. 
Yeah, they're only getting in because my cooldown isn't the greatest because I don't have wicked or Owl Sanctuary. Once I have that, it'll be. Hey, you get screwed. Hey, crown. And that's just with three power ups, too. If I had more, this would be even more absurd. Might, 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 my might, 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 my might. Okay. Since that is stat up, I want to grab it. Amount, though, is more valuable. The Janari is just here to do its best. And proc that sweet, sweet retaliation. Though probably not for much longer with how much wave beam is going to be popping off soon. Yep, that's a whole screen of Phoenix fire. The enemies are screwed beyond compare. I'm gonna have a lot of health back after this, surprisingly. But, uh... Hey, a level. Yep, that was a whole bunch of stuff that just went up. Can't think of how much better it would be if I... My damage has actually gone down. Because I healed back so much. I didn't even hit the move. Why are you moving? Okay, it's actually my D-pad causing it, not my joystick. That's strange. I'm gonna have to dig it out. Oh, growth season. Get all these sweet, sweet pickups. Mmm, experience. Now it's in luck season. I'm hot and daffy. Will that be anything? No, it can't be anything. I oh, should. Oh yeah! Look at that kill counter going up. That would be worse too. Oh man! If only I built for challenges instead of real challenges instead of dopey challenges like this. Get a real score. Might. What's my cooldown at? Yeah. Uh, still want Paranormal Scan to try and max that out. You know, it'll give other stats too. That'll be helpful for killing things. On the other hand, Raw Might is a power all its own. Da da da. Obviously, if you get it sooner, the better, but I did not get it sooner. Can't evolve early here. That's why Dex always goes to Abyss Plus Card, because you can get the Arcana right away and evolve early, too. Da -da -da. Man, that was a lot of levels. That was a huge red gem. Let's see if I can find another one. Hey, yes I did, indeed, find another huge red gem. Might, 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 might. Taking up the whole screen now, and nothing can stop him. My damage has actually gone down because my health is so high. Back up again. But it kind of doesn't matter when you're hitting this often. Yep, and if anything does survive, it'll just get annihilated as more comes up. Alright, let's get all these sweet, sweet red gems. Area, area, might, might. La might. I don't really think that multiple legionary mounts is all that helpful. Area, though, would be much better, so I should have grabbed that instead. The it is, the more it can hit things. Of course, I'm focusing super hard on wave beam, because that's the thing to do. But you see that amount plus one, and your brain just goes straight to it. 
<laughs> so little, and it's so much. Ah. Ah. Hit over 100. Yeah, things are going to get very silly. Still 1500 despite my health steadily going up. Will you get anywhere close to me? Oh, you can get in pretty close. It won't matter once the Phoenix Blast hit through. And I have the actual Azkizabur hitting nearby anyway on the back end. Something does happen. Oh wait, no, I had Rapid Fire on. That's what was happening. Man, it's a lot more might coming in. Coming in hard. Coming in fast. Coming in killy. Oh, there was a boss there. What an adorable attempt to not die. Well, you stand nothing against the might of the paranormal scan. What an absolutely absurd weapon that is. Absolutely crazy how broken it is. <laughs> might get that might get it high, make it bigger to the sky. Ah, now the audio is completely broken now. They're barely showing up on screen. So, without ye old hurry on, this probably could have broken like 300k. Oh hey, an enemy got close. Got close. And that was HP scaling. They didn't know it was a hardy foe. But, you know what they say. You got bone down in the bone zone. And by bone down, they mean crush them beneath your heel. Down under your heel. Kill them all. Turn them to bone dust and use it to raise plants. Hey, enemies are showing up on screen again. That's nice. All right, curse season exists. Ah, uh, not for long. All right, now let's level up. Oh, hey, Drowner. Hi, Drowner. You sure tried your best. I'll make sure to give you a sterling recommendation into the... I'm just going to be random always now. It's not like it matters at this point. It really doesn't matter at this point. <laughs> oh, right. Three. So I can't actually grab the Ar... Well, I can. I'm just not going to grab the Arcana. Remember when enemies showed up on screen... That was a dicey time, wasn't it? But thankfully, we have fixed that problem and have nothing but giant birds of flame on screen. The Phoenix Blast, everybody! It will destroy all. Now, obviously, basically anyone could do this with Divine Bloodline. But the extraordinarily high base damage of the Phoenix Blast in comparison to other things makes it even better. Though my damage is going down, so, you know, that's funny. Ooh, look at all them brownie bots and legionary going. I do so much damage, my damage goes down. That's a confusing video title. Bye bye. No vacuums have shown up either. Is it the joystick? I just. Hmm. It's weird. Yeah, that's a. I didn't even hit anything that time. I mean, this happened a while ago, too. I was doing Pal World, but I thought it got fixed. I mean, it's not sort of drifting. I think there's some, just some gunk sticking it on. 
I'll look into fixing that eventually, maybe. Probably not. Like I said about hats. Nope. Didn't say anything about hats in the Discord. Oh, right. I should have moved and grabbed XP. I didn't... Wow. I might actually break 200,000. That's Divine Bloodline for you. Even in hurry, it's unbelievably strong. Oh, wow. They're getting in close. That's very impressive. I mean, you're not going to break through this level of health, and I have another revive on the back end. you just make me even stronger if you did. So, please, please hurt me. Please hurt me more. Yay, level ups. Yay, enemies dying horribly. Hey, it's back up to 15k. I'm moving again. Why? Why is this happening? Well, now they're not standing chance anymore. And just think, there's probably an Arcana that'll make this even better, too. Uh, let's see. Yeah, I grabbed Boogaloo early, too. That way, then, the retaliation would kick off, too. That way, it would always be triggering that, or the Phoenix Blast, and the damage would just keep going up and up and up. Am I still getting health? Yeah, 12,000. Not even building for it that often. Yep. Yeah, it's going up. Not particularly fast, but it is. And, well, they're not going to chew through 10,000 health, no matter what they are. Oh, right. I keep forgetting to grab my dang growth season. And even if they do, well, they're going to just run base tap and be taking more damage. Wow, they're actually doing it. On. Well, literally. That was not nearly as many levels as it should have been. I guess I was moving too fast. Oh, hey, Death. Uh, da, 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 da. Looks like I got some three Ks in there. Hard to tell when they overlap on you so much. Two thousand damage hits. Three. Yep, there's some three thousand. Let's see how fast I come. Uh, I didn't hit two hundred K. Still pretty impressive overall, though. How long can I keep this going? Okay, this is my last ride. Wow, that's a lot of candy rocks. They give me so many dang power-ups with Brownie for some reason. Okay, let's see how much you popped off. Half a billion. Something that wasn't optimized all that well. Not bad, not bad.